Yo! Wait, no, that's that's the wrong video. Sorry, I think I have video recording PTSD. <laughs> I, I don't know what to say other than like, I was on I was on such a deadline the last couple of weeks uh, with the Christmas video and the montage video that it's just been a little bit, just a little bit nuts. So I do appreciate everyone's patience with this video because I, I want to take a day off. Wait, Jet, why is this video called I want to delete half my videos, you might be asking. All right, you screaming in the middle of class. Shut it, I'm getting there. What is this video? This video is, is just uh, me chilling out, just talking face to face, less funnies and such. Guess I know, less funnies. Karange, right? That's how you say cringe if you don't get it. Just, just say it that way. People get really annoyed and it's great. This is technically a channel update, I guess. <laughs> But I want to just be speaking a bit frankly, even though I obviously have a script. But I just want to be speaking my mind, even though it's all written down in front of me because I'm dyslexic. I'm going to be saying it wrong anyway. Whoa! Yay! Why do I want to delete half of my videos? I will start this whole ramble with one simple quote. The numbers only really matter to me if I've earned them. No shortcuts. I want to delete slash hide half of the videos on my channel. Which ones and why? Simple as it gets. If you've been paying attention to my channel for a bit, I have sort of hard stopped playing Fallout 76 and thus so stopped making any content around it entirely. It, it's just sort of um, how it's gone. <laughs> why did I stop? Just stopped enjoying it, eh? <laughs> I don't know. It's... I got to the point with the game where I was kind of just logging in to do nothing. I, I barely kept up with it. And after taking a long break, I just sort of stopped playing it. I didn't come back. I didn't have any thoughts or dreams that would make me want to come back and play it. I had nothing come in my mind of, oh, I want to go do this. Oh, I want to go do that that I have with other games today. And the only thing that made me want to come back is the preconceived notion that a lot of my subscribers, because they came from Fallout 76 and uh, Fallout 76 content, they would probably just watch that video a lot. Why do I want to delete those videos or unlist them specifically? Because they are a part of my history. Given how YouTube works, it's highly likely that if someone finds my new stuff today through the algorithm, through me making a title, through it getting recommended to them, they may sub for that. They may be like, damn, this Jet guy really entertaining. I like his content that he makes. But because of that old Fallout 76 stuff that has so many views, you know, I think the original uh, 20 something guide video I made, which I keep updating the year on because I don't know why I keep doing that i feel like it's it's kind of just so people can see it easier it has like a hundred and something k views it's like i would say 40 percent of my entire channel views because they have 500k all up <laughs> so it makes sense that the algorithm would just go hey this guy made this a lot of people like this why don't you try it it has a lot of interaction when in reality it isn't interesting at all and it isn't something they're interested in and frankly i just don't want that if i go ahead with this i'll end up just unlisting all of the guides that i made and putting them into a playlist now it'll still be on the channel it's not like it won't because i know there's some people in uh, who still watch my stuff because like oh jet said something really smart back then you'll still be able to find it because i still want those people to be still be able to get the help that i i wanted to give them back then i just don't want that to be the main focus of my channel anymore if that makes sense otherwise i would just prefer it to stay out of what my channel currently is before anyone says anything i don't regret making those videos i enjoyed and loved them at the time i did i, I did genuinely enjoy making them they were just fun to make you know i enjoyed making them in the moment because they were really cool but these days i enjoy challenging my creativity and trying to make something you want to watch based on keeping your attention and that's difficult but i know i can do it i thought i would at least put this to a vote because given that i'm making the video title i'm going to delete half of my videos it might get a few people's attention and i would like to know what you guys think cast your votes on that please uh comment down below say your thoughts i'm just not sure but at this point those views don't really matter to me anymore okay i've talked about this too much if you have any thoughts on that please leave them in the comments down below and i will respond to you simple as it gets if you want to bring something up bring it down the, bring it up in the comments i will have a conversation with you even if it's constructive criticism even if you're really mad i will talk to you about it i don't mind just don't be aggressive usual stuff like that just be respectful that's all i care about and yes i still have plans for a Fallout 76 video, but 
it won't be anything like I used to make at all. It, it will be like I, uh, what I make today, entertainment first. There'll probably be a lot of cuts, a lot of funny things, clips popping up, music, the usual stuff like that. It, I guess you could say it would be similar to Fallout 76 from scratch, but not really. I'll be doing a homage to what I used to do, and also on top of that, I'll be making some people really happy. I don't think I'll ever do more than that. I'm definitely not going to make guides like I used to. I just, I, I don't see it anymore. I really don't. I'm sorry. If that's something that breaks your heart, like, oh man, Jet's gone. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. <laughs> but I'm still here. I'm just not doing 76 guides. I'm, I'm just as funny as I was before. I promise you. <laughs> Even if it's something you're not interested in, I'm, I'm sure it's still funny. If there are so many people just hating on this idea, I might really consider. But at the end of the day, I just really don't feel like I earned any of those views. Those views weren't because people liked me. Uh, even though, don't get me wrong, a lot of those people who did watch those videos, like Bean and such, I love you Bean, Baba Doodle Mom, and uh, there's a bunch of other people. I think a person named uh, Vault Me, uh, they commented on the 4K special, and a bunch of other people that don't comment and are actually just more, more silent. I know the people that comment are technically the vocal minority, and the people that don't comment are just in the background and just watch the content of those. I just want to say, for people that found me that way, I wouldn't change that for the world, because that means everything to me. You know, I think about it sometimes that just the idea that no matter what I make, it won't just sit on zero views. That's that's pretty big for me. Like, it's not just going to sit there and have nothing going on. Someone is going to watch it, and that's going to get someone's attention one way or another. And obviously, you can argue that if I stuck with 76, those views would probably be bigger in general, because you find more people like that, more people like being like the people that do like to, to comment and the people that don't just like to, you know, chill out and just watch it and move on. It doesn't feel right doing that. It, it doesn't. It's It genuinely doesn't feel like I've earned any of it. At least with if I'm just being a personality like I am now, like that's the content I make. I'm just growing based off of who I am, being genuine, being jet, being funny, that kind of stuff. It obviously is going to take much longer, but in my mind, I'm earning it and I'm working for it. And that's the way that I want it. That's the, that's the way that I want it and how I want it. That's simple as it gets. I know if I ever make it, there's going to be those uh, those channels that are like, Jetto first started out as a Fallout 76 guide channel. When in reality, no. All making those videos really showed me. Making it isn't impossible. That my videos can get viewed if I just keep going. If I just keep trying to make myself a content, my thumbnails, my titles better. Just keep making good content and eventually I'll make it. It just showed me that videos that I make aren't just always going to get no attention. And that's all it really did. Because if you don't know, I didn't start out as this. I started out on Twitch. Uh, I before that, even when I was very young, I started out on YouTube uh, making videos that basically no one watched. However, there was a video back in the day had like a thousand views and it was just like Minecraft Pocket Edition seeds. So I should tell you everything you need to know about who I was as a kid. I didn't start here. I started back then and I just made a bunch of new channels, kept trying and trying and trying. And all this really did was teach me is that if I just concentrate on being a good content creator itself, making good content, then by all means, I will get attention eventually. And that's all I really care about now is earning that attention, earning the people that want to see me based on me jet a genuine person a funny guy and just someone who makes good content that's what i want to grow as i want to help people in a more making their days brighter way if you catch my drift to take anything away from these last few minutes, uh, the numbers only really matter to me if I've earned them. No shortcut. I said it at the start and that's how it is. So right now, just getting 50 views a video or even less than that, maybe 30, even if I'm getting even 10, the reality is, is that, you know, when PewDiePie first started, he was only getting six, but he even said the six people really liked the videos he was making and that's why he kept making them. And that's that resonates with me because I know there are some people who really like whatever I make, no matter what I make, and they're going to enjoy it. And that's why I like doing it because I'm making content content for those people. I'm making content I'll enjoy as best as I can because those people are going to watch it and laugh and maybe it'll get seen by more people, maybe it won't, but I'm content with those people enjoying it. And yeah, it took a lot of breaks for me to get there. It took like a good month of burnout just wasting away for me to go, man, I just want to show these wonderful people who still love me, who still who still love my content, that I can still make good stuff and I'm going to make them laugh. That makes me happy and that's why I do it at the end of the day. Not because, damn, a thousand views sounds good. Oh damn, a hundred thousand views feels really good. And don't get me wrong, Wrong. There's definitely a lot of serotonin that I used to get from those views, so when I don't see that anymore, at, at the beginning, it definitely was like, damn, I don't get them anymore. But now it's like, it, it's such a different feeling. And I would rather pursue that and then also be getting that feeling and the serotonins from the numbers going up. And we both know, and both, yeah, you, as the viewer, you are a both, not a multiple. <laughs> You're just one person. You as the viewer are all the one, one mind. 
a hive mind. I know that if I just keep making videos for you, eventually YouTube's just gonna pick it up because at the end of the day, I'm making so much stuff, it's getting viewed all the time. Why not throw it out, right? And eventually I'm just gonna hit a title and it's gonna be like, whoa, this is great. And they'll be like, damn it, thumbnail's good. And they'll click on one of the videos and they'll just watch all of the backlog of content that I have, which is how I find content creators. I just watch one video and then it starts recommending me more. And I'm like, damn, I wanna watch more and more and more. And eventually it'll just hit a point where I've watched all of it. And I'll be like, whoa, whoa, I, I need to say sub to this guy because you know he'll keep making good content. That's just that's the secret of YouTube. Most people are gonna sub to your channel when they click on one video randomly and they watch the rest, the whole backlog of content that you have. So you just gotta keep making good content and eventually you'll succeed. That's how I see it. Anyway, I said I was gonna move away from it and uh, yeah. <laughs> but now, now that uh, that's over and all the people who clicked on this video, uh, because they probably put Swat76 in the thumbnail in one way or another to get their attention, are gone. Let's move on. So, channel update. We're going to be playing over this year. The first video that's going to be coming out is Choo Choo Charles. If you don't know what that is, uh, I don't. I know Killer Train, shoot Killer Train, go. Frrr, that's all that matters. We've also got Bum Simulator coming, Breath Edge, Bear and Breakfast, Barony, Dave the Diver, Death Road to Canada, Ember, Endo Parasitic, High on Life, The Long Drive, Spider Man, Overland, Oxygen Not Included, Project Zomboid, obviously, as per usual, Played Up, maybe, Trolley Problem, and Wrestling Empire. But that's only to name a few. I have a lot of old games that I want to play as well because they sound really fun. Like I thought about playing Daggerfall or, or Morrowind online. Uh, I have more plans including, but not limited to. I would like to restart the Fallout 3 series back from 2021. And I want to give it like a full remaster slash reboot. And yes, that probably will include me making the same jokes uh, again. And I'll just rewatch them and get them uh, back in the newer video because I'll be bringing it back up to a newer standard. However, I want to do a full remaster. I want to bring it up to today's standard. I want to use my creativity to destroy that video. I want to have those Wilburger ideas come into my head and before I would go, man, I can't create that because I don't know how to do it. And now I'm going to try. I'm going to give it everything I can. There's going to be anime walking scenes. There's going to be the whole like circle around Megaton and me walking in. It's going to be sick and we're going to do it. I'm going to love it. I'm going to work it out and we're going to do that. However, yes, obviously the first jokes that I made in the first uh, couple of episodes are probably going to be reused because I, I, I don't know what to say, guys. I, I think I've peaked. I can't get funnier than that. <laughs> I was just funnier before I suck now. There is a lot planned for this year and I hope you will get excited for it, but I'm excited for the Fallout series. Uh, Fallout 3 series, it's probably going to go from that over to uh, New Vegas and then 4 because I really do want to play 4 again and then I'll probably do like Skyrim and then that should probably leave us uh, ready to go into Starfield. I might do Starfield in the middle, it really depends when Starfield comes out, if it comes out. But then they might just throw a curveball and say, ha, huh, Starfield never existed and they might just bring out Elder Scrolls 6 instead. So that would be funny. Uh, let me know if you guys want any more Yu-Gi-Oh stuff. Uh, I can. Now, I said I didn't want to make guides. However, I did also say in that that I might make a Yu-Gi-Oh guide. I was being serious. I can make a guide for that, like a beginner's guide, so you can understand what the hell is going on, so you don't just see cardboard going down. You've got no idea what's going on. Not to mention, that'll probably get some attention, and that might get me, you know, from that one video, might get me enough money just to buy a new mic, and that would be really nice, honestly. So... Uh, and I'd be happy to record more of my matches when I go on Tuesday and Thursday and just upload them with some, you know, voiceover and stuff. Because that's pretty easy content to make. It's pretty chill. Um, yeah, I've got no issues with doing that. And it wouldn't really be the worst. I just refuse to do it to such a high level like I did last time. Because I feel like that was a little much and didn't really need that much. Also, it wasn't that great. It was okay, but it wasn't that great. There was too much vlog stuff. If you're watching it because of YouTube, like if you're watching it because of Yu-Gi-Oh, you weren't really getting it. And if you're watching it because of me, you would have watched it for like those first few seconds where I was being funny. So I need to find a good mix between that and the other video to make it good. However, it was still really funny uh, for me to watch back on when I was doing the montage. So I can't be really mad at that. I just know that a lot of people probably aren't going to understand it because Yu-Gi-Oh! Please comment down below what you're excited for what you're excited for in this year or if you would like me to play anything because keep in mind i've also got like moonlighter because uh, diego said he wanted it and i gotta play that for my boy he only wants one thing he just wants me to play one game on the channel he also wanted me to play tiaria i'm gonna be honest he did want me to play that as well i'll add it to the list i'll see what i can do i'm sorry diego all right i'm sorry <laughs> I'm trying, but if you want me to play any game at all, just comment it down below and I will do my best uh, to add it into this year. It's a long, it's going to be a long year. There's probably loads of games that we're going to end up playing. Probably a lot of Zomboid because I'm going to get lazy and be like, damn, I, I need to get, oh, man, it's been a while. It's been like, it's been like three days since I, I've recorded a video. Man, I should do something. And that'll probably be like months in though. So let's be honest. We'll get to that point eventually. But uh, yeah, please comment right now. Come on, go right now, down right now. Comment. I'll wait. I'll wait a few seconds. 
So with all that said, hope you guys are excited for this these videos that are going to come out. If you don't mind, I got to get back to work on these videos. Also subscribe to the Patreon so you can help me buy a new mic. <laughs> I'm getting there, okay? I love you. Goodbye.